Well, the first thing you have to realize about conservative rhetoric is that their primary goal is to eliminate any competition to wealth and power. All right. So it is not surprising to hear conservatives talking about unions as if they're the plague and they have to be banned and eliminated. It's eliminating the competition. Now, I don't hear many conservatives talk about the bad things corporations do. In fact, they think liberals that all, liberals want to see corporations eliminated. That is not true. That's not true at all. Corporations are a necessary part of society and they're a valuable social organization, but as of now, they have too much power and influence, okay? What liberals want is for the power and influence for corporations to be curbed somewhat. Now, a union is one way of dealing with a powerful organization like a corporation, okay? And there are reasons why unions are necessary, okay? And we can talk, we can rationally discuss and argue the problems associated with corporations, unions, governments, churches, all kinds of social organizations, and we could potentially come to some understanding of the problem and possibly come to some understanding of what's necessary to fix these problems, okay? But meanwhile, we've got the conservatives who are of the opinion that anything that poses any sort of opposition or competition to a, a corporation is evil and has to be banned, okay? <laughs> I'm sorry, but I don't buy that at all, okay? So as long as the eliminationist rhetoric is still coming out of the conservatives, you can bet that they're being controlled by corporate interest, all right? Their primary goal is to eliminate any competition for corporations. That's what they're doing. Just remember that. That's all for now.